live. In theory. Let's see. Let's update Twitch. Twitch says I'm live. Cool. Streamlabs does not seem to have recognized. Nope. There we go. And Discord is recognized. Okay. There we are. So. Where last we left off. We made it to the end of Act 2. And we got wiped. Which is... Oof. Uh, let's see here. The boss did a lot of burn. And we needed a lot of direct damage. Fugo says hydrate. You got it. I got you, gamer. There we go. Hydration acquired. Carbonated water. Once more into the maelstrom. So we're gonna want it something that can target backline. Yet remains. And dot is not super usable. It's feeling like. Obviously, it's fine getting there, but it falls off super hard in that fight. You must face your failures, or be consumed by them. I mean. It still works on the main body, but you need, you need solid, like, physical damage hits for the uh, actual lungs. That said, I hereby acknowledge and accept the fullness and severity of my mistakes. To resentment. Reyes can't do this. Left unsurfaced, grievances gain a terrible strength. Subsequent months were measured in melted candles and mounting disappointments. All right, crossroads, here we are. A beacon for the broken and the battered. So, what are we thinking, chat? Whoa, lore. Yeah, I know. They throw lore at us. Let's see here. We've got a ascetic. Okay. Hemophiliac. Crusader. Defiant. Ooh, pyromaniac. Warrior of Light who's nervous. Breacher Vestal. <laughs> Crusader? Okay. We got Fugo the Crusader. Metal and man. Soldier and sword. Forged in the fires of war. Now then, who do we combo with him? He's got good frontline damage. We do have combo potential. So maybe we take someone to set up combos for him, like a Jester, maybe? We do Razor's Wit, and then upgraded Fade to Black. We do have Natural Swing, which is nice. All melee skills. Just sprained wrist. Jeez. Uh, let's see here. So my main concern right now is hitting rank four. We need someone who can really just hammer away at rank four to deal with the lung that's going to be hiding out back there. Murderous melody lingers. Do we maybe go for like a the uh, final chord has been struck? Ooh, we don't have the gun focused Dismas. We can maybe see about going for it though. We run pistol shot as sort of our main ability. Three to six as opposed to four to eight. Take aim for crits. Robber was pretty all right. Gentry Fury, combat versus plague eater. We could maybe run a uh, good dead eye. 
How do we run Venom? Rank flexible roll that expands the graveyard of Bruce Blight capabilities. Throw in Dagger. How's this changed? 3 to 5. 3 to 6. Ignores Guard. I see. So, it comes at the cost of that, from the looks of it. Absinthe. Removes Blight. Gives Blight resist. But you don't get dodges anymore. Poison Dart gets one additional base blight, and then two extra blight if stealthing. Hey, how's it going, Katori? You looking to jump in here? We're still putting a party together. We're figuring out who we want to bring. So far, we've got Fugo the Crusader. how we target out position four. Paracelsus the goat? Gotcha. Indiscriminate science stains the surgeon's hands. Can we fit the whole thing? No. Alright, we got Katori Blue. <laughs> Plague Doctor. Uh, let's see here. Just Katori? Gotcha. So the dots work on the main centerpiece of the boss, but not on the lungs. And we want to keep the lungs at bay. We need some way to really deal direct damage to the back. Something like a sergeant man at arms, maybe? Vanguard, which is all about reposts. Let's see here. Repost gains plus one damage and minus eight percent resistance per use, stacking up to five times, meaning plus five damage base, which is actually really good. But minus forty percent resistance. Courageous abandon and repost effects are collectively referred to as Vanguard buffs and debuffs. Effects Bellow, Courageous Abandon, which we don't have. Repost, which I think just means the token. And Standfast. Remove all Vanguard buffs and debuffs. Heal 10% per two debuffs removed. That's kind of interesting. <clears throat> Why is Necrophobic a bad trait? Like, I get that fear is bad, but the opposite is also bad. Uh, so this is, let's see here, Fear of Cadavers and Symbol of Death. So this is like getting beat up by a zombie. Getting beat up by a zombie is kind of a little spooky for this guy. And he just really hates fanatics, apparently. Yeah, I'm thinking maybe some sort of sergeant. We drop hold the line. All allies ahead, strength when HP is under 75%. Bulwark, repost, inflicts days. Hold the line. Okay, yeah, this is the one that's all about, like, block stacking. This is the taunt effect. Uh, maybe we run something like Beneath blood a and Hellion in position emptiness. one, so that way we can Iron Swan in the back. Sickly sucks. Sluice Tactician is not the greatest. It'll be nice if we decide to go to the sluice, but it's an optional zone. And so it doesn't really help us in the fighting in the entire rest of the place. Chemophiliac's actually gonna really suck for uh, Crusader. But we have a cleanse, because we have Battlefield Med. 
Still an opening? Yeah, we're still uh, we're still putting a comp together. We're figuring it out. Contraption. Any particular class calling out to you? So far, we've got Fugo the Crusader and Katori the Plague Doctor. I'm thinking we need solid direct backline damage, not just dot. Dot damage is great, but we need direct for the lungs. Highway? Okay. Hunted. Harried. A fugitive seeking to outpace the past. Maybe we do these two at the front. We do a rogue. So we've got, you know, a bit of a brawler set up. We can drop... What do we drop? I feel like I'd still want to have the ability to do pistol shots. Maybe we drop tracking shot. So, in most scenarios, we just do the typical highwayman shuffle, duelist advance, point blank. You know? But then, if we have the position set up right, we do have the ability to still shoot backline with pistol shot. With rogue, we don't get the guaranteed crit, and we don't get the blind cleanse. But we get speed and extra reposts. I feel like that just might be a bit excessive, actually. It's, it's a lot of reposts. Or maybe it'll be just enough. Let's find out. We'll run it. So, we got Highwayman, who's going to be shuffling, can help deal with both. We've got our dock. We're probably going to set up like this. And now, what do we do for position three? Do we do some sort of like position three flag? That could be interesting. Necrosis requires the target has blight. Require wait requires target blight, but it targets enemy, targets whole party. Okay, so it does three to six damage to the entire enemy party if that position has blight. Which admittedly that does combo pretty nicely with. Lights from Katori. We don't have a good way to de-stress this flage, though. Like, the flage can endure to take stress off other people, but then we have the issue that flage is going to start causing a lot of negative relationships. Nobody's going to like him, because he's going to be really toxic. <laughs> Could maybe take Jester. So Jester's in position three. We open with a Razor's Wit, which moves forward one. Shuffling Contraption back into third, but Contraption can Duelist Advance moving forward two up to position one and is pretty much just unaffected because of Rogue. A murderous Thank melody us. lingers. Long after the final chord has been struck. Battle ballad, echoing march, encore finale, inspiring tune, play out in solo. Let's see here. Battle ballad. Next encore gives strength. We don't have encore, though. Next encore has stress resist. I think we're just going to run Wanderer Jester. And then maybe see about getting some more skills. Big boy and activities going on right now? Yeah. I'm trying to figure it out. My only real concern is we get to the final boss. And our option to hit the back lung is contraption being in position two. But if we want to do, you know, the usual highwayman song and dance, we don't have the ability to do that. 
So we would need to kind of leave contraption sedentary. We can definitely run this comp, though. I think this will work pretty well for us. Let's do it. The road is yours to travel, but you are not alone. We're going to want Burn Salve for the final boss on somebody. Maybe Katori, no just return. stack all the cures. You with open arms. I the forgot to pick a path for Katori. Oops. Giving way. slice off. Keep it simple. Because we don't have Holy Lance or anything to shuffle Fugo back in the front. I just realized. The fiend's strength dwindles. he wastes his turn doing a protect the child. Fair enough. Should have hit him. Okay, he did a protect the child. And that's yeah, that's the whole fight. We're good. In we remain unpunished. Gloom, a spark. Strange sapper coming out. Okay. Okay. If you insist, game. Yeah, I'm thinking we change Katori into being an alchemist. I think we're still just on Wanderer, right? Yeah. Oops. Hydrate, you got it, boss. There are yet places such as this. We're a little light still. Alchemy gathers. Master, yeah. We do have Bounty Hunter available. We never hired Bounty Hunter. Do we do we just do it? We just hire a bounty hunter into like Jester's position, just to see. It could be a huge mistake, or it could be the thing that we needed. <laughs> what are we thinking, Chat? Do we try it? Let's go ahead and the get Katori set up. Alchemist. Probably a mistake, but let's try it. Let's try there it. There is no man behind the hunter's mask. Hire only a terrible thought. When you want something done right, hire a bounty hunter. Barasa. Let's see here. Collect bounty. 50% damage when target has combo. Comes with the sharpness charm. Okay. Mark for death. Sets two vuln, removes dodge, ignores dodge, and protects. And Okay, that's pretty good. Come hither. Pull two. Set up combo. Caltrops. Target's back line. It's a bleed. Flashbang. Shuffle. Blind. Daze. Or stun if the target has combo. That's kind of legit. Defiant. Round start. Heals 5%. Whew. 
austere, prefers the simple, simple life. This is actually pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. The ability to remove dodge, really nice. But, uh, let's see here, the combos, that sets up for 50% more smite damage for Fugo. Not to mention, you know, being able to shuffle enemy team and all that. Days when the target has combo. Yeah, it's actually, it's a pretty solid kit. Let's see here. We're gonna go ahead and upgrade our cure. Bounty Hunter has already mastered his abilities. Badass. Okay. Professional. On time, on budget. Okay. <clears throat> Upping the damage by four minimum, three max. Okay. Bonus for post damage for several turns. And round start gain repost. Duelist advance gives block plus. Execution two. Execute two actually sounds really valuable. That allows us to bypass a lot of armor. Spend what you can, or wealth right. no longer has meaning. So, what pet do we want? We got the orphan wolf did. cub. Extra positive relationship chance. Pygmy Pliskin. Healing received from skills per medical gear item equipped. Random hero after each location is healed 10%. We also have the Unnatural Owlet. 5% debuff resistance piercing per Tinker's gear item equipped. Increased chance of producing items from stagecoach items. I'm thinking we maybe just stick with the Wolf Cup? I don't know. Uh, do I want to pick up Burn Self now? Let's see here. Where can we go? Everywhere. The Sprawl. In ruin. To get a Field Stone Everywhere. from the Crusader. In need. Apply to attacker when hit. Burn. Self Radiance skills. Get plus one fire damage dealt. Turn end. If combo, gain two stress. Anti-commerce. We have to not visit the hoarder. <laughs> I mean, honestly, that that seems pretty doable. Another nameless city. I want to say Burb, but it Another might not be the best. Of we don't have madness. Tinker type gear. Let's see here. Increased chance of producing items from stagecoach items. So, I don't know if we got like the work table loom, it would give a bonus to that. Let's see here. I think I want the shrines of reflection because we need to unlock more skills for characters, honestly. And I think we just route to try and get a bunch of skills. We just grind a bit. Obviously, we try to win, but... We go Shrine Map. And, yeah, we're gonna go Orphan and Wolf Cub. A couple of Burn Salves. Invigorating Intoxicants. Glimmers. A bit of comfort on the road to damnation. Alright. Your coach must be made. And what are we naming him? To carry you where you must we gotta go. we gotta name our little wolf cub something. We've had buddy, we've had bootstrap. This will so what are we well. naming him?
Come on, chat. Let's see some names. We gotta name our orphan wolf cub something. Otherwise, I'm just gonna name him Buddy again. <laughs> I don't know. I'll take it. There we go. We got, I don't know. The orphan wolf cub. <laughs> Alright, we're heading to the sprawl. Let's do it. Yo, bounty hunter is stanced up. My goodness. <laughs> Let's do it. We have to dodge hoarders to get the field stone. Behold, the great cities of man, ruined and aflame. Let's see here. We could go lair. Or we could go through this middle unknown path. We have to dodge the hoarder. So, I'm thinking we do one of these two, Shrine of Reflection. Man, it's denser than a black hole. <laughs> black holes wish they could be as dense as me. Uh, I think we go to Watchtower, up through this, whatever it becomes, Shrine of Reflection, Shrine of Reflection. And we just get a bunch of stuff. We've already done the Plague Doctor story. We started some of the others. Does Bounty Hunter have a story? That'd be kind of interesting to know. Alright. What do we think, chat? Lair into a street fight or unknown? Do we brave the unknown? We don't have any loathing to reduce. But we could also just do the first stage. Unknown always? Okay. Let's do it. Let's make it happen. We ball. Never in hey, even the <laughs> Katori in the party is like, yeah, unknown. <laughs> what is popping, y'all? Hey, how's it going, Glenn? You looking to jump in as our bounty hunter? Nobody, well, I guess, technically speaking, people here have seen combat, but... You want to be Glenn the bounty hunter? Heck yeah. All right. There we go. He's untested. We shall see. Ooh. All right, Katori. Taking us to a cache. Yours is a soothing presence. Let's go. Take up these goods and Academics imbue them cache. with purpose. Extra burn salves is nice. Tinker's bench. Chance to produce contraption items. Laden lantern. Flame resistance piercing. But if speed is less than or equal to 2, 10% chance to get blinded on turn start. Alright. Extra burn salve never hurt anybody. Especially not here. When did we get pilfered wealth? Hey, yo. If relics is greater than 10, 10% crit chance. Reap skills, steal positive token. Reap skills, minus two relics from inventory. <laughs> Reap can steal positive tokens, but can also cost us money. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you know what? Why not? Pilfered wealth. Shrine of Reflection. Whole party's in agreement. Alright. Look ahead. We need to get tenacity to for Crusader. Remember and reconcile. All the paths for Crusader affect the skill tenacity, and I have no idea what it is. 
It must be important, though, if it's being changed in every, like, permutation. By confronting the past, Let's we go. learn to face the future. Oh, Bounty Hunter does have a story. Oh, no. Just leave. <laughs> okay. Twas to be a harsh winter. Chapter 2. Hard Pressed. The banners of the Holy Army snapped in the biting wind that scoured his barren plot. Taking the quill from the attending officer, he signed his name crudely upon the weathered scroll. He had no love of violence, but his absence would stay Famine's hand. He accepted both tabard and blade, bid his wife and son a stoic farewell, and rode out reluctantly to make war. What a badass. Battle heal. Kills the target 20%. Cooldown 2, uses 3. Requires the target's HP be below half. That's solid, honestly. <laughs> I missed the little dialogue pop up because I was looking at stuff. Okay. Target has minus healing received. Alright, for now we'll just keep our current set up. We're gonna go watchtower. Don't want to be forced into the hoarder. Oh, spicy chat. We're going to be running out of wheels. I think we'll get away with it, though, actually. Unless this one unknown up here is another wheel. Let's find out. Loathing. Okay. <clears throat> Assistance encounter. An elementary problem. We have to dodge the hoarder. The trinket that we're going for. It's our goal. Anti-commerce. Mind your wheels. They have nothing left to give. Yep. Centuries of human learning and achievement ruined by riotous Buff? contempt. Hey, yo. Let's go, Katori. Let's see here. 30 light and some sort of scouting, maybe? Minus 25 light, but money. Minus 5 light. I want the. I want to keep the light high for the extra banter chance, even if the scouting is not particularly useful. Reflection. Everyone said ho field hospital. Nope, we're out of wheels. Sorry, fellas. We ain't got no wheels. <laughs> the loathing festers. Hydrate, you got a bus. Chapter 3 The Great Crusade All we have is the will to fight True. The cacophony of conflict rang bloody in his ears Trumpets and drums shouted orders The screams of the dead and the dying But in the maelstrom of mortal combat He found a divine peace he came to relish the cleaving blade and zealous bloodlust, losing himself entirely to the terrible delights of battle. Bulwark of Faith. Self block two. Taunt two. Two region for three turns. It's a pretty solid tank skill. 
frankly. I mean, we actually have, aside from Katori, a pretty durable party. 48, 42, 48, 22. So unless they can, like, snipe out Katori, this party actually... We got some beefy fellas here, I'll be honest with you. Region sounds really nice. Alright, well, onward we go. Heal the healer. <laughs> Not a yeah, basically. We just gotta protect... Protect our little... Plague Doctor in the back. Bulwark, my beloved. Life hath no mercy for any amongst us. Chapter 4. Blood in the Snow. Oh shit, playable? Oh, this the is the enemy guy. Camp rang with the clamor of terrified recognition. They knew his frightful reputation. Remove strength, remove crit. Holy Lance, let's go! There it is! Versus to the days, that's awesome. Dodging this one. Bulwark's on cooldown. Fair enough. Just gotta swing it out. Mercy. There you go, showing mercy. in humiliation and pray we do not meet again hardcore man at the moment of execution he demurred this one could live on in humiliation a mockery of the mercy his enemies knew he did not possess <laughs> hardcore dude we also still don't have tenacity <laughs> uh, I mean Oh, onward we go. We are going to have to do a boss in order to make it to the mountain. The real question is what boss?
bonus speed could be nice to try and put us ahead of the cherub. Can we just go ahead and for now? Combo set up for Fugo to. Ooh, nice. Come hither. Get over here. Judgment. Cycled that guy to the back. He does die to his dot, but I'd like to make him die faster, preferably. Can we collect into third? We can mark, we can come hither. We can caltrops into third. Miss. Fair enough. Spilled all of them all over the floor. He's dead now. They both are. So, fair enough. Luckily, they uh, didn't get to do too much to us. If we crit, we kill because of execute. It's wishful thinking. First down this one. So we either get Fugo's 50% bonus damage, or it's going to be the extra resistance pierce that we don't need for Katori. Because we've already got full blight chance. was pretty solid. Got extra bleed resist. Honestly, might put that on Fugo. Because he's got minus 30% bleed resist already. Takes us up to 60. Go ahead and drop Reap in favor of Bulwark. What's nice about us having been so combat light here is we actually have decent chance for positive relationships because we don't have any meltdowns. So this sets us up for later success, actually. I hadn't even the really thought about that. The place is a little worse for wear. Greedy, Tangle Scrounger, Melophobic, Misses the Mark. All of this gotten from the Stumbling Corpse. Commerce completed. Apply to attackers when hit. Burn. Radiant skills deal extra burn. Does not like having combo on them. Uh, I think we go with this. 
misses the mark sucks. We can see about going for like some field Consider hospitals, anti-commerce, big game. Greater Protectorate, 20% healing given from skills. Or we can visit a creature den. Oh, minus flame drain is also nice. I kind of want to go to the Shroud, honestly. The real question is... Oh, wait. Bounty Hunter's gone. Hello again, Jester. <laughs> okay. We did get the, uh, the Bounty Hunter's uh, trinket, though. Fair enough. Bounty Hunter only just pops in for Experience, a bit. Experience, however painful, is the greatest teacher of all. Taunt 3, Region 4? Frankly, I'll take it. Yeah. Alright. Uh, so, I'm doing some thinking. It's how do we kill the bosses of each of these zones, basically. So if we go to the tangle, we need at least two people hitting position four per round. So we can have contraption use take aim. Or not take aim, but a pistol shot. So that's one hit. But we need a second hit, which would probably come from Plague Grenade. The issue with that is that means Katori is always taken, essentially. Their action is spoken for. Actually, I'm wondering something now. So, there's a status in this game that I don't recall being in the first game, which is the immobilized status. Cannot move or be moved. And I recall in the Shroud, uh, this boss has like a, a hagpot mechanic. Or sodden crew. Uh, it, it's more hagpot because it disrupts your formation. So, yeah. It's it's a hagpot mechanic. But because it's removing the character from the formation, I wonder if you can deny that, actually. If you have immobilized and thus cannot be moved, can they fail to remove you from position one for the drag down effect, you know? I don't know. It's an interesting thought experiment. Uh, let's see here. Let's do this. Conventional fare, but fairly priced. Someone's a curmudgeon? Who's a curmudgeon? You're a curmudgeon. Greater chance of negative relationship. Oh no, you just won't play. That works fine though. Nice. We got some extra positives. Your coach must be maintained if it is to carry you where you must go. Also got the burn self back. We can save that ultimately for the boss. We can run neutralizing powders.
I think we're gonna try for the Leviathan. I think we can do it. I think this team has enough like direct damage that we can deal with the hand, even if we're like a person down. Let's make it happen, chat. The shrouded coast, isolated and drowning in amphibious degeneracy. Yes. All right, let's see here. Hopeful. Aspiration unites the hope. Inspiring cry. Nice. Wicked slice de stresses Fugo. Respectful. Oh my Tried god. And tested. Chat. A bomb to be counted on. Chat. It's so peak. It's actually so good. They're being nice. They're being friends, finally. It only took to part seven to just have people be friends. Friends till the end. Have the highwayman and crusader form a positive relationship. <laughs> The game knows. Oh, floats listless on the tide, brined in noxious degradation. All right, I'd like to hit Lair. Lair is here. Okay. Well, there's only one route to it, so let's be about it. The unknown awaits. Tori calls for mystery. Bill patch. Okay. It's gonna be an Oblivion's Ingress. So we've got a cultist fight coming up. The beautiful illusion that was the world. All right. Fragmented. Last second setup. Undone. Let's do it. There's blood to spill. Kill them all. Let's prevent some bleeds. Measure out your violence and apply it judiciously. Slice off. All right, it's got two crits locked in. Kind of scary. Should be positioned to be dead. Ouch. We have Katori do a heal. This wound at least has been tended to. We missed and they got a crit. Scary. Okay. maybe? Nah, we need to take care of the debuffer in the back. Hydrate, you got a boss. The 
Cherub needs to die. Issue. We're still blind. There is beauty in Why our imperfections. <clears throat> Misses the mark. Ah. Dang it, Fugo. Still got a good hit. Give him no quarter. Malaise. Measured and steady. And wanes. All right. Now that we've got that set up, the contraption can just execute position two, and we don't have to deal with that crit. Awesome. Straightforward and effective. A calculated generosity. But a welcome one, nonetheless. Ouch. Alright, we don't want to shuffle Fugo out. Do we just give Fugo two strength with this? Move forward one, give them strength. But Fugo also gets a strength because we use it. Let's give it a try. Oh my god, we give him two strength because of respectful. Let's go! <laughs> Hey, here, they'll never advantage. see you coming. <laughs> what a buff. If we max roll, no. I was looking for damage. Seems like we can maybe get an execute. Not quite. Battle ballads on cooldown, fair enough. Just gonna kill the cherub. Keep it simple. And now contraption set up for a kill. Except it gets a turn. Yikes. We're fine. Another impediment. Cleared with impunity. Not too bad. A little rough around the edges. Burn resist, rat skull, highwayman. If first in turn order, gain a crit, 33% chance. Take aim skill, skills ignore blind for three turns. Target tracking shot skill gets minus stun resist versus creature minus 66% healing received. That's interesting. The loathing. Yeah, let's go ahead and put it on. Cool. Alright. Up to the lair. We're balling out. I trust you have calculated your odds carefully. This will not be easy. Yeah. This will be fine. I'm sure nothing bad will happen. It's famous last words. Up. Sacred gear. The Church of the Chain. Four bleeders. Katori is up next. Rotting timbers. I'm gonna ask prevention, because they're gonna try and bleed us. Sucker punches. The mine's grass grows tenuous. Barnacles, gotcha. <clears throat> There's the sucker punches.
Two of them have stealth from Briny's Ring. Don't necessarily want to be shuffling right now because of need. Forty-five percent bleed resist. Nine to fourteen. Okay, yeah, we just kill him straight up. What if I do? Measure out your violence and apply it judiciously. Backline's dead. Two health, three blight. Cool. Frontline needs to die. We got our whole team coming up. Uh, let's see here. Katsori, we're gonna have to cleanse that bleed and do a little bit of healing. Do we smite or do we stress heal? Then we go ahead and stress heal. We'll do it on Katsori. It'll still stress heal contraption anyway. Bleed. Relief comes rarely in these times. Savor it. And there we go. Cool. And we'll just go ahead and play some sick jams. Uh, let's see here. He dies on his own, unfortunately. I was hoping we'd be a little bit faster than him so we can do a little bit more recovery, but it'll be alright. Captain, the Fishmonger, and Big Boy. Weakened already? Okay. Fishmonger is getting a second turn here in a moment. I think we're gonna want the, the uh, bleed resist. From Flynn's. Yep. Resist. Awesome. Weaken for now, so we're just gonna go ahead and consume it. Get repose going. Try to put out some dot. Misses the mark. Yikes. Okay. Prepare to take the punishment of the gods. I believe in you, Fugo. All hands on deck. They've got crits. Oh! Holy shit. What a hit. Oh, it's coming again. An unavoidable Jesus. Enemy. Thank you, Fugo, for being an absolute unit. Times to not have Holy Lance. I think we need to move Fugo this turn. Heal him up. So he can continue to take the absolute poundings that they keep giving him. Jeez. Fishmonger. Awesome. He has no death armor. Yeah, he's dead. Cool, cool. Oh, 
was completed. Uh, you wanted to kill Fisher folk, I believe. The Leviathan's breath thickens the air. Land the killing blows on two Fisher folk. with the execute. Ouch. God, it's so much damage. Alright, get through all that armor. Just execute. a little worse for wear but we need a trophy so if not this one then we have to do one in the next region I think we can do it let's make it happen they must be made to see that their monstrous god is mortal So it's going to be grabbing either Fugo or Katori. Ouch, there's a lot of damage going out on Katori. Alright, the hands are going to start doing some nasty things here soon. We're just going to prep some damage on it. Let's just get it out of the turn order, frankly. We'll have Fugo start tanking. Tori will have Tin to himself. A simple kindness. Interesting. So it did ignore the time. It was not forced after him. They both missed, but that deals with the blindness. I think I have to throw onto the boss, though. We need more damage going out on this boss. We've gotten, like, reposts. So 
That's gonna batter again. Ouch. Way to the back. Okay. Damn, leave him alone at this point. Hold him forward. Measured and steady. Okay. Double death door. Come on, Fugo. Resolute. Ah, uh, fair enough. is at one health, it dies to dot. We can heal Fugo, maybe? And then Fugo goes and tanks with a bulwark. So that'll take the heat off of Katori. Back contraption. Last heal. Hopeful. Cooperation. I was hoping for key. a heal, but debuff resist, hella good. Ninety percent resistance. 90% death blow resist. Risky. We use an invigorating intoxicant. Rat skull. 15 damage. Don't want to shuffle contraption right now. Resisted movement. That means immobilize would work. Okay. Absolutely immobilize would work. Because it's just a movement. Keep the buff up. Keep his blinds up. All right, hands are here. Scary. Alright, and Contraption is under. Let's try and get him out as fast as possible. Oh, it's a huge crit. Jesus. And wings. Miss. Awesome. Lines are working. Oh. She understood death, but could not defy it. He 
You still standing? Nope. Not all who Rip. seek redemption will find it. So, weaknesses in the comp. I wasn't generating a lot of block tokens, so Fugo was just kind of face tanking a lot. Uh, honestly, I probably should have put more blinds onto the uh, enemies. Just give them less and less chance to hit. Fight through the fatigue. And I feel like if you want to go after Leviathan, protection is definitely like a thing that you need. Pretty much, we would have, you know, let's say man at arms just to keep it simple. Man at arms and someone else get struck. targeted by the boss. Man at arms uses defender on the other target, so then when the hand comes up, it can only grab man at arms. Maybe. That's the thought process. This comp wasn't quite built for this boss. But we got a lot of knowledge. Ah, there it is. Feared by many. Known by none. Knowledge and experience. Twin yardsticks of progress. Also, oh, four candles for just one region. The greatest horror, it would seem, is nothing at all. Let's see here. Okay, so his other skills are purchased through there. Target ounce of prevention skills gain block. Emboldening vapors gives a regen, but battlefield medicine heals less. Flexible roll with stealth arms and stuff. Need 16 candles for that, which we don't have. This would give us the ability the to do the true splendor of a world. Hope rekindled among 25% of the altar of hope. Neat. And let's see here. Working fields. Spare a thought for tools of iron. Such implements will serve us well. Alembic and Retort. For each location, chance to produce concoction and powder items. Okay. A drop Leeches of sanity. Remove disease. In a sea of madness. Restorative herbs. Traveling heal, healing received from skills. It's not bad. Alright. Well, let's run it back. Sanctuary. As fleeting as a dying star. Face your failures, or be consumed by them. I hereby acknowledge and accept the fullness and severity of my mistakes. Resentment. Reyes Captivus. Dying Star Left Syndrome? Surfaced, Elaborate. <laughs> grievances gain a terrible strength. Ooh. 
We had managed to grasp a thread of connective worship that stretched across vast gulfs of time and tribe. But we did not understand it. The crossroads. All right, chat. We're back at the crossroads. Let's hear them. Who are we taking? Who's going? Who's staying? What are we doing? Deadly Jester? Eagle Eyed. Deus Volt. All right, Fugo's running it back. And man. Soldier and we got and Katori the Occultist. Forged All right. in the fires of war. Let's see. Who else do we bring? Do we maybe bring like a flag position to? Zealotry. Flag is flexible, so we can do like a flag plus uh, highwayman, maybe? Vendetta. <laughs> okay. There's actually a little team name for this. Okay. Uh, I'm going to go use the restroom. I'll be right back.
I'm back, chat. Sorry for the delay. Uh, let's see here. Contraption wants to be a flag. Gotcha. An undying blight upon the soul. Now then. What do we bring with this? Flag is pretty flexible. Roll that revels in divesting others of their burdens. Toxic state gains new effects. Horrifying. Let's see here. Sepsis. Gets a whole bunch of, like, blight stuff. Okay. Deathless. Is now a self and target heal, but requires self HP be lower. Nash's gift, self horror one, but remove a bunch of stuff. Okay. Suffer. Requires the target have any of that? Yeah. Steal it all. It's kind of interesting. Exanimate. Let me but sample the bitter taste of death. Low health grants great potency to blight and buff alike. Punish, Acid Rain, Sepsis, and Lash's Gift. If HP is below 50%, plus 2 Blight Delt, plus extra Resistance Piercing when target is combo. Yeah. Acid Rain, plus 2 Blight Delt when below half health. Uh, let's see here. Lash's Gift. Self, heal 10%. Uh, buff, crit... Remove all negative tokens, remove combo. It's not bad. Maniac sacrifices blight potency in favor of flexible positioning, debuffs, and disruption. Target steal negative tokens. Again, it's punish, acid rain, sepsis, and lashes gift. Punish is a knockback. Acid rain is a weaken. Sepsis transfers negative tokens, and lashes gift lets you pick up negative tokens. Probably like a more more, maybe. Undying. Cessus is now usable in all ranks. Okay. Flexible positioning, debuffs, and disruption. Hmm. Yeah, we can try this out, maybe. Seems interesting. Try Harid. Gunner Man. A fugitive seeking to outpace the past. Back rank roll that emphasizes range skill use. Of which we have pistol shot. And point blank shot. Self back to target knock back to.
four to eight. As opposed to three to six. Yeah, why not? We'll try it. It's going to be deeply suboptimal, I think. But Does Crusader have any hero paths? We do have hero paths. They all affect tenacity. Let's see here. Smite Reap Tenacity. Smite Rallying Cry Tenacity. Zealous Accusation Battle Heal Rallying Cry Tenacity. We don't have tenacity, though. We need to finish out the last chapter of Crusader's story for that. Yeah, let's see here. Zealous Accusation targets backline now instead of the front. And is only usable from the backline, so this is... Okay. Huh. Uh, Battle Heal gets more uses from the looks of it. Yeah, an extra use of Battle Heal... Rallying Cry. All targets gain Immobilize. Well, that would have been <laughs> interesting going into uh, Leviathan. Yes, yeah, so this is like backline buff based Crusader. Uh, Templar. Let the blows rain upon me. I will not fall. Self-sufficient defender who protects allies while regenerating injuries. Smite. Stress heals when the target is combo. Rallying cry. Target gets protected. And bonus healing received. And transfer health regen to target when the target is low health. I'm thinking tenacity has to be some sort of like health regen effect. That's what it sounds like to me. Then we also have Aggressor. Smite gets Execute versus Burning. Reap gets Execute versus Burning. And we don't know what Tenacity does. Maybe we try a Defender. I just realized we basically created like a weird almost like support leper. We've got Chop, we've got Hugh. <laughs> yeah, we'll try it. And then a cultist. We're gonna go ritualist. So we got ritualist, sharp shot, maniac, and it's good to go. The valley. Bam. So in terms of defense, we've got Fugo's guard, and we've got Contraption's taunt. Katori can also debuff enemies. The winds whip more harshly on the far side of the brook. The bulwark of your denial is giving way. Lethality writ large. It's me, Cataphract by S Purple. <laughs> it's not inaccurate. Also, does Flagellus this thing no longer blight? Yeah, it's just a weaken now. It's not a blight. Interesting. It's not really blight based damage. I forgot to get rid of Sack Stab.
a little more damage than I might have liked, but I could have played it we better. Are the flame, burning brightly for all the world to see. Crackles invitingly once again. Combo chance. Steals combo off the ally. Knockbacks more and creates combo. Do you claim on combo with this at all? No, it's just damage. Just damage isn't too bad, though. Maybe just do something like this. It's a really weird build, but it's like a healer flash setup. So we've got more and more to taunt and take damage. Undying to give out regions to teammates. I mean, we... We have... You know... Weird reconstruction, though. So we don't necessarily need... Zambi medic, yeah, pretty much. Let's see here. Each Wainwright. improvement, a new variable in the equation of your fate. What's really interesting is we could give region to Fugo, and then Fugo could give region and guard to somebody else. It's a really weird thing to do, but. Ooh. Reap, heal 15% when target has combo. I do have Bulwark. This is true. Upgrading battle heal. We've actually got a lot of healing in this party. Jeez. Uh, let's see here. I think we'll go ahead and pick up pistol shot. We'll get more pistol shot damage. Kind of our, our main source of damage. Block. Remove. Strength of crit. We get remove block. Time being, I think we'll just operate with that. Conventional fare. We pick up but wolf cub. Priced. All right. What are we naming the little pup? Experience. Though? However, That's painful, the real question is the greatest teacher of all. All right, and because I keep memeing about it, but never actually picking it up, we're gonna do it. We're gonna get the griddle. Everybody likes flapjacks. Griddle equipped. Is a good thing. We're making flapjacks, everybody. Something to ease the rigors of the road. Flapjacks, exactly. It's the flapjack run. Where are we going? Every road we have access to the Fotor or the Sprawl. Every turn. Traveling heals would be nice. Keep the flame high. Avoid the watchtower. We don't have any bear traps here, is my concern. I remember wanting to immobilize the boss in the foes of war. We could do the sprawl, maybe? Any goals that we need to complete? Let's see here. Fugo wants to visit two oasises. Contraption wants to land the killing blow on 
pillagers. Dismas wants to land killing blows on fisher folk. And Katori wants to use pouches of lie. We'll head to the sprawl for now, maybe. <clears throat> if the target is burning, extra healing given from skills. Range skills get debuff pierce. Debuff resistance pierce. That is actually really good. Random ally on turn start gets empowered and has a chance to be set on fire. Fog of war. Avoid the watchtower. We'll give it a try. Another nameless city. Another inferno of mutilation and madness. Uh, can we get any flame resist? Yes, we can. Who do we give it to? I think Katori. Less self-healing means more healing of the rest of the party. Here we go. The real question is, do we try for boss? Behold. The great cities of man. Ruined. Off to smite heretics. Hell yeah. Let's see here. Assistance encounter. Unknowns. Shrine of Reflection. We want to hit that. And then lair. Alright. Guess we'll just go straight for the time being. We gotta dodge the watchtower. It's a hoarder. Two armor break. Jeez. Got some burn salve. I didn't buy consumables. Hmm. His prison. Flagellant. I... Contraption. That isn't your face, right? Like... Like, that isn't your face, surely. You didn't just take that off because it was getting in the way. <laughs> oh, jeez. I don't like that series of emotes. I don't trust it. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and get people equipped. Your collection can wait. Press onward. Yeah, yeah. going to go get tenacity for Fugo. Yes. Damn it, I'm curious at this point. Hello, nurse. Let's see here. Do we have any negative traits that we really want gone? Gentry fearing. Combat service is plagued. Music is the trigger for deep-seated resentment. We lock in 32. Fair enough. Uh, those are in items, so they're not going to help us much here. Take the burn salve. So long, nurse. When deliberation is exhausted, trust your instincts.
why can we accept this? If HP is less than 50%, cooldown 3... Wait. Requires has a negative token or requires self. Okay, yeah. Fascinating. I guess we'll go ahead and do a more more, catch a little bit of extra flak and use it to heal. It's immune to debuffs. <laughs> oh. We can create combo at the very least. Crit seven. What a welcome one, nonetheless. Slurp. Flagellant moment. Let's go. The past is gone. Let we do have bear die. traps now. like the setup. I, I miss having punish. Just some sort of frontline to frontline communication. You know? Shrine, find out what the hell tenacity is. My former life a fetter. Nothing. Chapter five. No home but hell. Motionless upon his war horse, he contemplated the scene of stifling domesticity in the familiar valley below. The boy played idly in the muddy field while the mother hung sheets upon a tattered line. From his saddle, 
He planted his heraldic banner in the thawing soil, tossing the whole of his earnings in its shadow. He blew hard into his war horn and turned to rejoin his regiment. He did not look back. Hardcore. Plowshares to swords. Complete the Crusader's backstory. Radiance. Self. Healing. Range skills. Get 20% to flame piercing okay tenacity target gets two block fair enough and in our case also extra healing received well we can officially generate block tokens <laughs> Radiance is a self hot. Okay. Go. And we got another Shrine of Reflection coming up, which I guess we'll go ahead and start working on more Highwayman. Because we need more gun skills. We're running, you know, Gunner Man with uh, one gun. I guess two gun, technically. Of human well, I am the cataphract by S. Purple by being Ruined. frontline support. Yep. My riotous contempt. Freedom is nothing what I. Nothing like what I did before. Chapter two. Laying low. Harried by a pursuing garrison, he took refuge in the fetid canals of the city. Concealment took its toll. And soon he began to see himself in the furtive, scurrying pests that formed an unfortunate portion of his meager diet. Freedom, once so fondly imagined, had become a vortex of degradation. There. Open vein, a hey, the original starter skill for melee. All right. The loathing whispers. Fair enough. Well, do we hit the lair chat? It does lead us to a shrine of reflection. <laughs> Or we could go the route that offers us supplies. We can either pick the path of perpetual torment. Or the path that literally offers you goodies. What are we thinking? Mmm, shrine? I see. We're thinking we want to kill a boss, don't we? I've got this horrible, you know, just sneaking suspicion. My issue is our backline target, because the boss spends a good chunk of the fight in positions three and four. Uh, and we don't necessarily want to be destroying books early. Dismiss is our main damage. It'd be take aim into pistol shots. No, let's do it. We pick the path of perpetual torment. We limit test. We try and beat the bosses. I trust you have calculated your odds carefully. Not at all. This will not be easy. Fanatics. Go ahead and beefcake it. I believe in you, contraption. Let's take the absolute punishment of the gods. Let's see here. 
he's about to start swinging at us. Let's keep him weak. Back after an hour, what happened? Uh, the first run, Bounty Hunter left after a region, and then... Ah, oh, damn, minimum damage. Fair enough. Let's see here. Let's go ahead and keep him weak. Uh, we ended up wiping on Leviathan. Section. An unavoidable end. Scavenge what you can. And now we're going to try more. and push this comp to its limits, basically. We're going to try and take on the librarian. This might go very poorly for us. Beware what awaits you inside. Our party's durable, but the librarian does a lot of damage. The library burns, and with it, the remains of philosophy, reason, and insight. Let's just go ahead and bait for now. I'll take the hits. Bad humors. We have leeches left there. Mobilized, okay. Blinded and immobilized. Twenty three damage. Nice. You bastards actually shuffled contraption all the way to fourth. I'll be honest, I'm impressed. Upset, but impressed. Probably should have moved back. We'll see. Oh, did you get sick too? Bad humors? Syphilis? Ouch! Syphilis really sucks. Bad humors is rough, but. Woo! God damn. It's a little spicy. we go with our brand new syphilis fresh out the box all right weakening not weakening it was supposed to be vulnerability ah i'm dumb 
Okay. Let's go ahead and take aim. Load a crit. Ouch. to consume the dodge token. quite understand how the ignite mechanic works. That's one thing I've definitely been missing out on. They seem to just kind of do it at random. I wonder if it's when one of them is killed, maybe? Then allies still in the round after it ignite? In theory, the shaman ignites. Or doesn't ignite. If what I believe to be true is true. Okay, no, so he's igniting too. So it seems just like once any of them are killed, they start igniting maybe? Protected by Shaman. Yeah, I think it has to be that it's once one of the enemies dies, they all ignite. Time to limit test, chat. We're gonna go for it. We're gonna push these heroes as hard as we can. He teeters madly upon his ladder, reveling in the fiery destruction of human accomplishment. Already killed one. Yikes! 30 and a 45. Well. Jeez. Got the hit. Oh boy, here we go dying again. Just about. Let's see here. Let's go ahead and take the punishment. Categorize. What did that do? Let us take a closer look at the thing. As repulsive as it is. Targets all. I don't know what categorized does. Wait, there's there's still an unknown move. That's kind of horrifying, honestly. There's a move that we don't know what it does. Self, self. Take aim, just lock in the crit. Let's see here. 
Voln is not available. We can just do direct damage though. Cool. Tenacity is a self lock. Steady Ouch. yourself. Crit. Dodge is fine, we still get the heal. Fugo. Try and blind him. We got the blind. Let's go ahead and pull. Awesome. Still landed a hit. Unfortunate. It'd be amazing if he could whiff Page Burner. That'd be actually hilarious. Smokestack miss. Cool. Consume the dodge. Pick him up. the combo hit. Let's heal the healer. Does kill stealing his books do anything, or is it a bad idea? Uh, it is a bad idea, because once all the books are gone, he ignites. So, if you make the books go away faster, you get to the Enrage sooner, basically. Extinguished at last. Ouch, we're taking a lot of burn. got one round left. He's got dodge. It's kind of open. He'd throw it at Dismas. And then we just have a repost. Pop the dodge. Have a traction break it. Anyway. Well, next. We need as much damage as we can get here. Oh, fuck. There it is, chat. Ignite. Oh, fuck, it's coming. <laughs> Want to proc my level five? Agitator for max deeps. The greatest Stop proccing agitator. Stop agitating him. <laughs> Holy shit. He's gonna kill us. <laughs> oh, master stroke. Armor break. Holy 
Holy shit, we lived. <laughs> we lost Katori. But we will see them again. <sighs> we we won the fight. The we hit that of path faith. of perpetual torment. My goodness. Uh, extra flame delts. We make use of zealous, I guess. Let's see here. We do something like. Let's see here. Start with smite, zealous. Battle heal because we're gonna need the extra healing now. Bulwark of faith to tend to self. And inspiring cry to be our stress healer. Contraption healing received from skills. Fugo, extra flame resistance piercing. And we've got an immediate combat coming up. Oh boy. Look ahead. A place to reflect. Here we go. Remember and reconcile. Awesome. Love that. That was great. Sepsis is no longer dealing damage, I just noticed. Okay. I'll be honest, I kind of like just base flag. Not super huge on any of the flag paths that I've seen. Suffering begins. Let's see here. Got Zealous, make use of. Yeah, like debuff oriented flag is kind of interesting, but I think I prefer flag just. As regular flash, I'll be honest. Die? No, no, no. We're playing Darkest Dungeon 2. Let It Die was fun, but I'll admit, the game had some issues. <laughs> I mean, no game's perfect, but I was not a fan of some of the like, pay-to-win mechanics in the game. The future. Chapter 3 one last job. He was sick and starving, and in desperation, offered his expertise to an unscrupulous malefactor. Shackled once more to an unsavory task by an advance of gold, he lined his belly, girded himself, and prepared for one final heist. Highway Robbery ignores dodge, removes two positive token, and gives them minus five crit for three turns. It's a melee skill. Okay. That's kind of neat. It's not a gun skill, though.
Definitely gonna want to be able to remove enemy positives. Riding it out. Our protection has been stripped to its last. We're fine. It was enough. We chose the path of perpetual torment. Three damage, coin flip kill. We got Bravo. it. The slow suffering begins. Backline light definitely hurts. Oof. Encroaches. Check. Inexorable. Okay. Have my blind. I don't want. Enemy weakens and wanes. Let's test it. Wasn't he only at 9 out of 10? I thought I saw. Yeah, there was still one slot left there. Wait, what? I was looking at a stress track. There was still one empty. Maybe it was just like a display error, but. But damn it! He was at 9 out of 10! <laughs> Plus the track goes to 11. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. No, just goes to 10. Oh no. Build fast. For who this knows is bad pain. In the, beyond. the flame has turned against us. and steady. Seven to... Alright, we get seven, we kill. Seven or eight, we kill. Six. Rip. Okay, we gotta deal with armor. Unless we get a mulligan. Righteous action. Here comes the check. Still standing. Respect. Uh, hmm. We're gonna have to. Don't necessarily want to stress. I think we're gonna pop a more and more. And we're gonna hope, basically. Okay. Fair enough. Maybe I should have just popped it. Then again, people 
people are still standing. Self-reliance is a rare and wonderful thing. Flage moment. <laughs> Nearly full health. Hey, there we go. Straightforward and effective. All right. I was signaled for food a little bit ago, and I don't like leaving things unfinished. So I think we're going to take this battered, broken team and retire them at the end. Haggard, tired eyed, all are welcome here. Let them play some cards. Just for the meme. The fire is lit. The table is set. Nervous. The inn awaits its favorite guests. Got the head. Apparently, people are getting mad over GoFish. <laughs> All right. That said, I'm gonna go ahead and end this expedition. Every league collect them. Learn from each attempt. Deepen your understanding. And victory will come. Alright. And with that, I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this stream. So. I gotta go eat and all that good stuff. But for now, take it easy, everybody. Have a good one. Peace.